Good morning, y'all. Have you ever had somebody send you something that was just too good not to share, but maybe a little too much to type? Well, my dad sent me something the other day, and I thought it was awesome, so I was just going to share it with you. If you take this basketball right here, you put it in my hands, yeah, it's worth about 15 bucks. That's it. But you put that basketball in the hands of LeBron James, it's worth about 30 or 40 million. You take this football right here, you put it in my hands, it's worth about, I don't know, ten, eleven dollars probably. You put it in the hands of Peyton Manning, it's worth about fifty, sixty million dollars. Depends on whose hands it is. You take this golf club right here, you put it in my hands, ah, it might be worth fifty bucks, maybe. You put it in the hands of Tiger Woods though, it's worth eighty million. You see it depends on whose hands it in. If I have a stick in my hand, a rod in my hand, I might could beat away an animal or a wild animal or something trying to come at me. But you put it in the hands of Moses and it parted the Red Sea. You put a slingshot in my hands. It just becomes a kid's toy. You put it in the hands of King David and he slays the giant with it. See, it depends on whose hand it is in. And, you know, two fishes and five loaves of bread would feed me with some bread left over. You put it in the hands of Jesus and it feeds thousands. Depends on whose hands that it's in. If I had a couple nails in my hand right now, I might would build you a birdhouse if you're lucky. Might nail down a piece of wood. But you put them same nails in Jesus' hands and it leads to salvation and eternal life for folks who love him and folks who trust him. You see, it depends on whose hands that it's in. And your worries and your cares and the things that's got you stressed out, if you leave them in your hands, that's all they're ever going to be. But if you put them same worries and cares and your problems in the hands of Christ, he's going to see you through it. He's going to take care of every need that we got. Y'all take care and have a blessed day. But just remember, it depends on whose hands that it's in. Give everything you got to God and let him handle it for you. Take care. We love y'all.